What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another video. This your boy Tate. I'm back in the building. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, thanks. Man, it's been a while since I did that intro, but anyway, let's get into it. Okay, so the purpose of this video is to find some trimmers. Now, I am in no way a professional. Let me get that out there right now. I'm not a professional, but I do want some quality trimmers when I trim my beard. Now, I stopped going to the barbershop a long time ago. I kind of just cut all my hair off or whatever because I got tired of going and the prices were just like ridiculous at this point. But every time I look up, I'm always replacing a pair of trimmers like this. Now, these hit me up for about $29.99 at Target because they were the hottest and best rated at the time of this video. So I was going to pick these up. Then I thought about it. I keep replacing these every two months, every three months months or whatever because I use them pretty much every day to kind of trim up and shape up so I decided to pick up a pair of these because these are wired and the longevity of these probably can be better than a pair like this these are $89.99 at the time of this video but the regular price is normally around $99 now a few things for $99 this is an upgrade of a box because normally the box would look something similar like this I'm gonna post that picture somewhere up here they normally look like these and these are only about 30 bucks so that's an upgrade in itself but i mean we want to know if they cut better i mean it's good that they upgraded the box for the 99 price tag but again we want to know how long they're going to last which isn't going to be this video but we also want to know if they cut well now they do make these wireless i didn't even know that I, in fact, when I went into Sally's to look between the two, I did not know that I was going to fall into like this, this twilight zone with endless and endless amounts of trimmers. I thought this would probably be the only one there, but there are so many T-liners slash outliners slash whatever you can think of to line up your beard, your hair, whatever. So it was endless. So if this video does relatively well, I, I will be back in there to buy me some more trimmers just to do another video so we could compare and contrast. Or if it doesn't do as well as I think it will, this will just be a one-off. But anyway, without further ado, let's get into the unboxing. So what we'll do, we'll, we'll start off with the cheaper one. Okay, so outside of the box, you get your actual clippers, you get some guards or whatever, but I won't actually use any of these guards, but they are there for people who actually use those. I only use these bad boys for lining and kind of trimming. Uh, it does come with a brush. So whenever you're finished or you're actual in between trying to get that hair off the clippers, you can kind of go at it like this. It does come with a bottle of oil to make sure that your blades don't rust. And it does come with a charging cable, USB-A to, I want to say this is like the oldest Android charger ever made. This may be micro USB. Other than some shears and a comb, there are no other brandings other than the warning signs on the back of the clippers. But that all gold feel is just okay. There's like a dark fake gold at the top where the actual cutters and blades are right here. And as you can tell that the screws are probably already fading already. Um, and the bottom part where the charging port and everything is, is actual like that same dark gold, whereas the sides are like a more, I don't know. I, I expect this to fade over time is basically what I'm trying to say. There is a guard to stop hair from accumulating underneath the blade, but I don't really like that because it makes it hard to clean. But I guess in long-term use, we will see. Yeah, if you turn them on, there is a green indicator right here to let you know that they're actually on. For 29 bucks, this is not a bad set of trimmers. This is how the trimmers actually sound. It's not too bad. Okay, so the T Outliner Trimmers by Addis. Uh, as far as the back of the box, it's high speed motor, quality close cutting T blade. Um, we have carbon steel, which is what they're made out of, uh, contoured grip, which, okay, I guess will help you from not dropping your clippers, and iconic finish because these are a iconic pair of trimmers that again you can find in any professional settings okay so out of the box you get the guides and everything you get some random stickers of different colors for addis i guess you just want to go slap those bad boys on stuff i don't know you get a thank you card right here from the company which is pretty dope and you get a car sticker 
uh, let's see if I can put it at an angle so you can actually see it. Right there. Addis, I guess you just slap this in the car to let people know that you bought a brand new pair of trimmers. Comes with a pack of oil, which is pretty good. That's a lot more than what you get with the $30 ones. Oh yeah, this is gonna last you a lot longer, uh, but it is included, so that's pretty good. Um, the cable, of course, is already attached to the actual clippers, and you get a guard on the clippers already, and for some reason, they look and appear to be oiled up <laughs> for no apparent reason. Oh, they are oiled. They do have oil on the clippers already, which is pretty dope. You don't have to worry about them rusting inside of the box. Now, they do feel relatively grippy. Um, I'm assuming that's why they have these rivets right here, so more grip for your thumb. These are relatively small than I remember, or smaller, should I say, than I remember, but they do have that iconic look of T-liners by Addis, so I'm excited about that. So this comes with a relatively long cable. Instead of being rechargeable, you don't have to worry about losing any power with these classic bad boys right here. But for the price of $100, this is what you get in the box, just the clippers, the guard and the actual oil and some thank you stuff with some stickers. Whereas the $30 one comes with the clippers, no guard, but it does come with replacements right here. Or, or, or should I say it doesn't come with a guard cap or whatever to protect the actual trimmers, but it does come with different size uh, guards or whatever uh, for bulking or anything like that. It does come with a brush to clean it and it does come with oil, even though it's not relatively that much and it comes with the charging cable. So for 30 bucks, you do get more with this, more value than the Addis, but I, again, I think the Addis is going to hold up longer, but again, that's just my opinion and based off of how many of these I've actually replaced already. Also, it is important to note that Addis on Amazon provides replacement blades for their particular trimmers. So that's something that the other trimmers do not have replacement blades. And these blades not only fit the ones that I have featured in this video, but they feature four other blades that Addis has available in stock. They're universal and interchangeable, which is absolutely dope. So I can actually change these from T-liners to the liners that are featured on this Amazon page. So for only 15 bucks plus some change and delivery fee, you can have another set at your door. So the repairability for the Addis is already beating these cheaper models. Anyway, back to the video.
Okay, so when it comes between the two clippers, keep aside the right side of my face is done by the Addis, and the left side of my face is done by these bad boys, the gold pair right here. I don't, I don't know the name of them, but we got the Addis right here, and then we got the gold bad boys right here for the left side of my face. And both of them feel smooth. Now, keep in mind, after I filmed that last video, of that last portion of the video, I did go in the bathroom and kind of go over it with the Addis or whatever. But um, for the most part, they both did the job. It just felt like the Addis was cutting a lot, was cutting a lot better. I, it's like I didn't even have to think about it, man. It was just happening. Um, both feel exactly the same. My face feels like super smooth. I got a close trim. I didn't even have to turn the clippers sideways in order to get that uh, close straight to the edge with the Addis. I was just boom on point. Whereas the other ones, I kind of had to turn it sideways to get there underneath my neck. Like, it just feels smooth, man. Both of them can do what it do. In closing, I'll give my closing arguments for both, but I mean, I, I see no difference. Um, again, the Addis was much sharper, so one swipe, you're already done. And of course, it's connected to a card, so. But before we even come off of this screen right here, we're gonna do the alcohol test. I'm, I'm kind of dreading doing this because I used to always hate it when I went to the actual barber shop. But we, we, we gonna do it, we gonna do it, man, for the sake of the freaking video, man. So this is the, wait, wait, let's see. Okay, so this is the side with the gold clippers. Okay. Okay, let me take the glasses off for this part of the video. Okay. No burning. All right, let's dab it a little bit more with some more alcohol. Sheesh. Let's do the Addis portion of it. I guess I kind of cut a little bit too deep. Oh, I don't know. I don't see no cuts or anything like that. God damn. Hold up. Hold up. Bro, why is this side burning, yo? Yo, them addicts don't play around, man. That blade is super sharp, yo. You got to be. Oh. <laughs> yo, like them kids be, bro, in the seat. Like, oh, man, bro. Let's do this side, man. Bro, the alcohol is not burning on the gold side. Like, but on the added side? Oh my God. Mmm. It's starting to feel a little bit better. Okay. So maybe you just gotta be careful with these bad boys, man. That's crazy. Woo! Okay, so when it comes to these two particular set of trimmers, I must say that I'm impressed with both. Now, keep in mind, you will have to charge these bad boys up in order to maintain a perfect cut or that, you know, that that superior cut. Whereas these bad boys right here, you know, they are fresh out of the box. You plug them into the wall and they're always going to give you that same amount of power. Trying to remember to power these bad boys up or charge them up can be like a nuisance. So I can see you running with the Addis. Me, I'm going to always pick the Addis, but I'm not going to diss like this particular pair of T-liners. Like these are a excellent choice for travel. Like you wanna throw this in your bag for traveling purposes cause you don't wanna bring your $100 Addis. That is a choice. And that is probably why these particular clippers are even made in the first place. So I'm gonna actually keep both. You know, I wasn't gonna take them back anyway because that store, if you looked in that video that I uh, featured on here, has a no return policy anyway and i wasn't planning on returning them anyway so i'm gonna keep both so these are gonna be more so of a travel pair that i have with me because they work perfectly so again these two particulars should not even be versus each other but i wanted to do it because i wanted to see which one i was actually gonna go for and i probably was gonna give one away but i'm gonna actually hold on to the both of these because both of them have their different conveniences and one of those is the card like the card is amazing 
because it gives you all the power that the Addis needs, but sometimes I find it in the way when I'm trying to turn the Clippers in certain positions, whereas these bad boys right here, they don't have a card. So it doesn't matter what position I turn these in, they're always gonna be ready to cut at any angle without a card being in the way. Anyway, this your boy Tate. Let me know what you got in the comment section with any questions, any comments. I am not a barber or a master barber at all. I did go to barber school, but I did not finish. So therefore, the only thing that I did was work on a mannequin and cut and shave and all this other stuff that comes along with barbering. So I didn't finish, so I'm not a master barber. So some of the techniques and stuff like that, of course, could have been better, but this is for at home use, which is the purpose of the video. So keep that in mind whenever you critique, but I'm open to all information and all things that I could have got better. Anyway, this your boy Tate, I'm gone. Peace.